So one of the things that I love about Samsung is just the simple fact of with these cell phone devices over here, you'd be able to share content between all of them through either you know S Beam or Wi-Fi Direct. And what happens is when you use S Beam, that's where you touch the two phones back to back, and you're actually using two different technologies called NFC and Wi-Fi Direct. And the other way you can do it is just straight up Wi-Fi Direct, which is basically like Bluetooth on steroids. And so when I'm talking about sharing content, I'm talking about pictures and music and videos and several pictures, several MP3s. You know, you can share something that is large files. And so one of the ways that you can do it is let's say that you are in a room and there's other people that don't have a Samsung Galaxy device. And so they're not capable of having the, the luxury of sharing phones by touching them back to back or using Wi-Fi Direct. Just have them download a free app off the Play Store. It's called Superbeam and it's one word. And then you have to also download it on your device. So what I'm going to do is both of these phones right here, the Galaxy S4 and this older Galaxy device here, uh, are both on the exact same Wi-Fi signal. So let's say that I want to share, you know, a picture between them. So here's a picture in the gallery. This is actually shot with a drama shot. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the Share Via icon. Underneath Share Via, I'm going to go to the Superbeam app. Once you choose on Superbeam, it's going to ask, hey, is the other device on the exact same Wi-Fi network? And I'm going to say yes. And so what's going to happen is now this has created a QR code with all of the details um, of the information. And so now that this Superbeam app is open on this phone right here, you're just going to place it over the QR code. It's going to read it. And then this is where it's actually going to transfer the file over. And so as you can tell, with a picture, it does not take long at all. So there is the picture from this device. Now, let's say that you want to share multiple things. Now on a, you know, the majority of all the Samsung devices file manager already built in. And so underneath the file manager, this is where, um, um, you know, I actually, I downloaded this one. Uh, here's the, my files one. This is the one that's already preloaded on the phone, but let's say that your phone does not have a file management system. One of the ones I would actually suggest is the Astro file manager. And this one is actually free. So I'm going to go to my files and then underneath storage, I want to make sure I just go to my normal SD card. And let's say I want to do several different MP3s. And so I'm going to choose a few songs here. So here's about six different songs that I just chose. And you just go to the more icon, go to share. And this is where we go to super beam again. And again, um, I'm going to do it on the exact same Wi-Fi signal and then open up the super beam app over here, place the phone over that QR code. And then this is where it's going to be transferring all the songs. And so as of right now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually pause the video for a second, but this says a minute and 30 seconds or so. So I'm going to pause it. So about a minute and 30 seconds has passed and I'm going to go into the super beam completed. And so as you guys can tell that this is where it's talking about all how the, the progress. And so it was about 86 megabits or I'm sorry, megabytes that was sent. And it was about six different songs. And so when I head into where it's talking about the songs that I have. So let me find where it says my music. And so I'm gonna go into the music player and then here is all of the songs that I actually just transferred over. And that's how that works. Now let's say that you want to do it to where you're not using the exact same Wi-Fi signal. And so what I'm gonna do is with this Galaxy S3 over here, let's say that I'm gonna choose a random song from over here. And I'm gonna go into here and let's do, um, you know, black and yellow. And so I'm going to head into the song, I'm going to hit pause, I'm going to go to share via underneath the menu, go to super beam. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this one off of the Wi-Fi signal actually. So I'll turn that off. And so this one actually right here has created the hotspot signal. So what's going to happen is if both phones are not connected onto the, the normal Wi-Fi or the exact same Wi-Fi, this one will actually create the hotspot to where this phone over here will connect to it. And so again, you just place the phone over the QR code. And now you'll be transferring that one song over. And now that they're connected, this one takes about, what was that? Three seconds, five seconds, I don't know. So now I'm gonna head over here, go to Super Beam Completed. When I head back into the music player, now I got my black and yellow that I just transferred over. 
And so that is how you guys would be able to transfer content, like such as pictures and movies and music, if you guys are not capable of doing the S-Beam or Wi-Fi Direct that the Samsung Galaxy devices offer you.